water really increases not only awareness and living in the moment, but it is a therapy for a lot of us. I'm Scott Brown. This is my son, Grayton. Yeah. And so we're out here today in the lower keys, getting out in the great outdoors. So that way we secure our family traditions, have a good time. So we enjoy fishing as a family because it, it forces us to get out of the house. It forces the kids to enjoy the outdoors. Naturally, subjecting your kids to the outdoors has positive second and third order effects. And so we want our kids just to learn a little bit of patience, discipline, and uh, some delayed gratification. Now when we catch a bonefish, we're gonna pick it up right from there. <laughs> <laughs> My wife and I, we never really taught Grayton how to fish, but of course, if you do something for so long in front of an audience, now he's catching tarpon bonefish a permit just like the rest of us. So you're a product of your environment ultimately. Bye -bye. <laughs> Not tarpon. <laughs> My free time is very valuable to me just because I'm very familiar with free time getting taken away to, to go execute um, really important jobs. With that being said, I want quality time with quality people and hands down, that's my family. kids get older, I want them to see how important it is to not only enjoy the outdoors, but um, inevitably take care of them as well so that their kids and future generations will have the same opportunities that all of us have. So I joined the Army in 2011. Uh, shortly after that, I went through the Special Forces Q course, made it to 7th Group Special Forces in 2013. And, Carried out multiple deployments around the world until probably about 2019 and uh, wanted some time with my family. So my family and I packed it up from Destin, Florida and came down here to the Lower Keys. To end that was become a guide. So I've been guiding since 2018 in Destin, Florida and uh, we've got about three years here in the Lower Keys. A good guide is going to know how to navigate human terrain. He should be a people person. It's not always about putting people on the fish, in my opinion. It's more about the journey, the memories you make, and the quality people that you get to meet. So naturally, I've been a teacher all my life, um, and of course, being in Special Forces, you, you are a force multiplier. The mentor and development is kind of what I've always been pulled to. I usually hit certain points in my life where it's like, all right, you've had your fun, it's time to pass it on. I think it's very important that we do a good job of mentoring and developing our future anglers um, because ultimately they'll be the stewards of our natural resources later on in life. 